Sonic the Hedgehog jumps a lot, so that is why in today's video, if I jump in every single Sonic game, the video ends. But before getting on with the rest of the video, this video is sponsored by E-Wing. Today I am very excited to announce my partnership with them. They're a very awesome company that sells gaming chairs, gaming desks, and other things. If it wasn't obvious already, they sent me my own chair. Now I personally got the E-Wing Champion series, but there's also other chairs such as the Knight series, the Calling series, Hero series, and the Flash XL. And because of this new sponsorship, you guys can head over to their website ewingracing.com, which will be linked down below. And I know those prices are a bit hefty, but if you guys are looking to buy a brand new gaming chair, be sure to use promo code GLOWKAZE to save an extra 20%. But I've actually been using this chair for a couple of days before I actually made this video, and it's very comfortable. It's actually, dare I say, the best gaming chair I've owned. Considering the first one I got, it was from Amazon, and the second one was a hand-me-down. I mean, this one is very comfortable. Like, in bed now it's a kind of i mean whatever and i'm not saying that because they actually sponsored this video but they actually asked me for my height and weight before they actually sent me the chair i feel like that's the reason why it's so comfortable because it was made for me but a huge shout out to ewin racing for sending me this chair out and sponsoring this video but anyway enjoy the rest of the video so we start out with sonic the hedgehog one and to make this a little easier for me i actually took off my um oh god wait can i just spin dash these Yes, I can. Okay. So, I took off the, the space bar to make this a little bit easier for me. Oh my god, it's going to be a little tough to get across hills. But we're going to see. Oh. Oh, okay. So, right here, we're just going to need a lot of momentum here. We can start out from all the way over here. And then make our way. There we... <coughs> oh, we start from all the way in the beginning. How about that? Okay, we're gonna start all the way from the beginning since we killed all the badniks in the way. So then we have enough speed to do absolutely nothing. Oh my god. So you're telling me I can run all the way from over here and it... <clears throat> Fine. So that didn't go as planned, but hopefully Sonic the Hedgehog 2 is a little different. Um, I'm not entirely sure how this one's gonna go because, well... Jumping is essential to Sonic games, okay? So, not being able to jump in some portions is definitely going to cost us, especially like right here. Like, look at how slow we're going right there. Oh, this is a good idea. Let me get this spring right here. Oh, we have so much speed. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Oh, I wish I could jump. Can I just spin dash this? I could probably just spin dash this, right? Yes, I can. All right, let's see. There we go. The spin dash is going to be a lot more useful now. Since we can't jump, the spin dash is an incredible tool we can use to our advantage. I did not get that checkpoint, but that's okay. Did we complete it? Oh, we actually got a stage done! Alright, the only thing I'm honestly scared for are boss fights. Besides that, I think, I think we're good! Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Yep, there's absolutely nothing I can do. Okay. Alright, next is Sonic the Hedgehog 3. Honestly, this is not going how I want it to go, but it's okay. God, I knew it. I knew it was going to happen. Alright, so, see if I can actually spin that. Ooh, I could probably spin dash my way onto the spring right here. Yes, I can. Oh my god, thank you so much. I hate that rhino. I hate that rhino. So and there's more spikes in my way. Great. Alright, Sonic and Knuckles. Um, This is already, ominously, I wasn't expecting much from the 2D games. I feel like we're going to do a way better job in the 3D games. But we did get one stage done in Sonic 2, but let's see if we can get a stage done in Sonic and Knuckles. We almost made it up top there. Hopefully that doesn't cost, it's going to cost us, isn't it? Yep, it, it is. God damn. Next is Sonic CD. I skipped the intro. Oh my god, how do we do this game? Okay, there we go. Alright, let's see if this one's a little bit... Oh, you've got to be kidding me. All right, let's hope I could just spin that. Okay, I can spin dash my way up there. Okay, this one should be a little bit easier. Um, hopefully, I don't need to jump. Oh, my God, I need to jump already? Up. All right, next is Sonic Adventure, and this game is really loud. God, I literally have this game at 10%. It's still loud. All right, so this is tougher because I am playing these games on controller now, and it's just kind of muscle memory to jump, so I kind of have to, like, literally avoid the jump button. So I'm pretty sure we can actually spin dash Chaos Zero, so let's see. 
We can can we not? Wait, can we not just spin dash him? We cannot spin dash him. Oh, this is gonna be. Well, I don't want to jump. That's the whole point. I don't want to jump. God, I'm telling you right now. I think I can do this level without jumping. Yeah, I don't think you need to jump in this level. Do you need jumping? I don't know. We've already constructed a hundred thousand dollars worth of damage. Woohoo! Look at all that destruction we're doing in the city of San Francisco. I feel bad for all these people. Look at that. We just killed someone. Woohoo! Excuse me, black car. See ya. In the afterlife. God, I love causing destruction in the city of San Francisco. Ooh, we could probably use that to our advantage. The spin dash? Oh, yes. We might have a level that's possible here. This is about to be fun. I actually don't think we need to worry about jumping as long as we have the spin dash on our side. We are good. We should be good. I just have to find ways to just angle myself correctly when I'm using the spin dash. So I don't actually have to use my jump at all. Oh, I think this is where I have to use my... Hold on, let's see. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. Good job, me. Ooh. The light speed dash is going to be very useful as well. All right, here we go. This is a very important part. We could not mess this part up. This does not count as jumping either. Oh, we messed it up. Oh, God. No, we messed it up. Oh, no. Uh, we got to... We gotta fabricate it in a way that we can... There we go. And if we... Oh my god. Dude, that part is hard. Because I could probably do that part if I execute it correctly. Let's do this correctly this time. Because if we do this correctly, it'd be a lot easier for us. There we go. Get the invisibility or, or not. Um, Could we jump up? Okay, I think I could do this instead. No, look, I hate this camera. Okay, there we go. Come on. Are you kidding me? And yeah, we could do this instead. Oh, <gasps> there we go. Oh my God, that should have not taken that long. That was so much easier than I made it out to be. Now that was the hard, honestly, that was the hardest part of the level. In my opinion, that was the hardest part without jumping. But now we actually should be able to do this. Oh my God, no, we, we got this. We actually got this. Imagine you got like five minutes to go to work, and then this is what you see outside. You just you just see your car getting towed, or not even towed, but destroyed by this big ass truck that just spawns here. Wouldn't that be a fun time? Do not tell me we have to. Are you kidding me? No, no, we do not have to jump. No, we don't. We have to jump to get the goal ring. We have to jump. Look at this. I'm literally touching the goal ring, and we have to jump for it. I did all of that just to get stopped by the goal ring. Are you kidding me? Look at this. I'm literally touching it. Sonic is touching it with his with his top wheel. That is so stupid. Next game is Sonic Heroes. Honestly, I'm not expecting that much from Sonic Heroes since you kind of need Tails from some sections. So we're going to see how this goes. Ooh, wait a minute. If I'm in the air, I could probably... Oh, you got to be kidding me. Hold on. I'm in the air. No, I can't leave it to you, Tails. Hold on. I actually might have just screwed up already. I... I think I actually... <laughs> I think I already screwed up Sonic Heroes. What about his restart? I think we should just rest... I can't even... Wait, why can't I restart? Can you not restart stages? Wait. Okay, there we go. I was about to say. What if we just start with Tails? Start with Tails. No, start with Tails. We start with Tails, right? And right here... We just start flying. <clears throat> okay. All right, let's restart this again. So right here we jump off and then there we go. There we go. Okay. Oh my God. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. God. Do I have a spot to fall off right here? Let's see. Oh my God. We can't just walk off the stage here. Oh, we could use Knuckles actually. Okay, we're good. There we go. Here we go. Leave it to me. All right, since we could just walk off here, we could just walk off and then jump. Oh, oh no, 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 tails, tails, tails. Do not tell me there was a spring right here. There was indeed a spring right there. Great. And hopefully we don't have to jump in. Oh my god, we have to jump in here. We can't even jump in the water. Oh, that is so dumb. Hold on. Let's see if I can figure out a way 
to not jump here. Oh, hold on. I might have just figured it out. Come on. There we go. Oh my god. Great job, Tails. Great execution. Let's go. We are doing more than what I ever expected, bro. This is actually great. Come on, Tails. Keep going. Keep it going, Tails. Oh, yeah, I've got to be kidding me. See if I could actually make it up top. No, we can't make it up top this time. Wait, let's see if I can go back there. And, oh, excuse me. I don't need you here. See if I could go back here. Where is everyone else? Why is it just Knuckles? See if I could make it from... Did I just jump? No, I didn't jump. Wait. Dude, I don't think I can make this. Oh, we are stuck. No. <laughs> Next is Shadow the Hedgehog. I'm going in the Shadow the Hedgehog with zero expectations. Next is Sonic 06. Oh, gorgeous, my love. So, we start out in beautiful wave ocean, which, honestly, I'm playing the original Sonic 06 right now. So I have zero expectations as to how this is going to go because, well, we, 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 we know how buggy Sonic 06 is. Uh, I should probably equip one of these, though. Okay, where's the purple one? Where's the purple? Give me the purple. Give me the purple. Oh, wait, does that count as jump? Does that count as jumping? Whoa! Wait. Wait. Does that count as jumping? Um. Does that count as a jump? I, I'm gonna. Oh, okay. You know what? I don't know if that counts as a jump or not. Oh my god. We might have found a cheat code if that counts as a jump. Perfect. Next is what I absolutely believe to be the best Sonic game of all time. Alright. And we start out with Act 1, Windmill Isle. And I'm pretty sure half of this game can just be completed with just the boost, but we'll, we'll see. I mean, there are some parts that you actually have to jump, such as the werehog parts. But besides that, I think we'll be fine. Oh, you mother. Next is Sonic and the Secret Rings. And as usual, we're going to skip the tutorial for this game because, well... Uh, nah, nah, we're just going to skip it, okay? No discussion. Thinking about it, we're not going to last too long in this game because I'm pretty sure we have to jump. In like in like about five seconds from now, we I'm pretty sure we have to jump. Yeah, we have to jump over here. Oh, I can't even. <laughs> Next is Sonic and the Black Knight, which I'm pretty sure is gonna be the same story as Sonic and the Secret Rings. Yeah, and we're gonna get stop right here, aren't we? Can we actually? No, there's no way we can get over this unless we jump, can we? Pressing every button possible. Yeah, I can't, I can't do this without jumping. Next is Sonic Colors. Honestly, we'll see how this goes, but I'm pretty sure I could actually use the Wisp here. It's helped me a lot. Ooh, we could use that as our advantage as well. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Absolutely not. We just have to jump in every single way possible. God damn. All right, next is Sonic the Hedgehog for episode one, which honestly, we just have not had a good day. All right, next is Sonic Generations, and this game took me forever to actually set up. I don't know why. I have no idea what was wrong with my Sonic Generations. Maybe rerun my config. Maybe rerun my configuration folder a million times. But honestly, I feel like Sonic Generations is going to go exactly the same way I did not want it to go. Okay, so what we're gonna do? We're gonna see if spin dashing is going to actually assist us here, and it's not. God damn it! There's gotta be something I can do, right? Super Sonic, can you do something? Can you... Hold on. Let me see if... Wait. Let me actually see if Super Sonic can actually do something for me. Let's see. This might be cheating, but... Let's see. Oh, you guys suck! Next is Sonic Lost World. And for Sonic Lost... Dude, honestly... I think the 2D level... I don't even know which one was easier. Like, I honestly cannot tell you which one was easier at this point because... Now everything's just... Just bad. I don't even think I can complete a level now without jumping. Because I don't think we... Have we completed a level without jumping? I know we did Sonic... At, no. We did Sonic Adventure... Well, technically... Technically... Are you kidding me? You actually cannot be serious. Can I go on the wall? I can't even go on the wall. Ooh. Okay. 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 So we skipped a lot right there. That's why I like Sonic Lost World. You don't even have to do anything. You can literally just take a different route for Sonic Lost World. I love that. The question is, will I have to jump at some point? Possibly. Especially over here. I'm pretty sure this is one of those sections where I think I might have to jump. As I was saying, can I actually make it up to... Oh, hold on. 
Can I make it over here? <gasps> Where did I go? I have no idea, but I'm hoping I progress in the stage. All right, fingers crossed that I'm close to the end right here. Okay. Oh, here. Okay, hold on. Can I? The nest is? Okay, thank you. Aim and fire with a jump. Okay, that doesn't count as jumping, though. Oh, no. We have to jump here, don't we? All right, next is Sonic Mania, which, honestly, this challenge is very... It's going terrible. I'm not gonna lie. I really thought that this challenge was going to be... <laughs> I'm, now I'm thinking about Sonic Forces, but I'm pretty sure this is gonna go just like the rest, and we're not gonna be able to do anything at all. I'm pretty sure this is just gonna be like... Just like the rest of everything, and we're gonna have to jump. I skipped the tutorial right there. Better kick things up a notch. Oh my! <laughs> and last but not least, we have Sonic Frontiers, which at this point, I I don't know what to expect at this point. I mean, I expect to die in the cyberspace level at this point. Like, there's actually zero expectations for me right now. I have no faith in myself to even get past this cyberspace. It's gonna be like, jump here, and then I'm gonna just foolishly jump. I feel like the funniest part- oh, hold on. I could probably do something here. You gotta be kidding me. Wait. Does a double jump count? Yes, it counts. Of course it does. Oh my god, I could do the thing, but I can't do the thing here. You've gotta be kidding me, bro. This challenge was something else. What a disappointing way to end the challenge. I was expecting to at least get through the cyberspace. This video went from if I jump in every Sonic game, the video ends to how fast do I have to jump in every Sonic game? <sighs> My god, oh well.